crazy, isn't it? Are you excited? This is the maiden voyage all hooked up. I am totally excited. All right. Yes, yes. This is way better than the Ford pickup truck. Absolutely. All right, I think we're ready to pull it out. Let them get back to work. Are you gonna videotape this, huh? Oh, heck yes. This is where I shouldn't fall out of the truck. So I'd like to introduce you to Rob and Alice, who just took possession of uh, DJ today. And we've got their smart car loaded up on the back and they're starting on their adventure, their one year adventure. There's their brand new trailer. Tonight's gonna be the first night in your new trailer, you're saying. That's right. And I'd also appreciate uh, if you would share what you think other people should know about your truck and how it worked today and what you noticed and saw. Well today I woke up and I was very excited because I realized it was the start of a really fun adventure. And what I didn't realize was that part of the fun was just learning about the truck and Greg and his wife Carrie took time all day to show us what we needed to know about the truck. When we first saw the truck we got super excited. It was just more than what we could have imagined. And the work he's done on it to make it so comfortable and wonderful for us and easy to drive um, was pretty neat. And I guess I am more excited than I ever thought I could be about starting this new adventure because we feel better equipped. And we thank him and his wife for taking us from not knowing what to do to knowing how to begin. Rob, what did you, you with your mechanical, your engineering background, your attention to yeah. detail, what kind of things did you see today? What did I see today? So, you know, I think the inside of the truck, it's a, a Volvo VNL 780, and the, the spaciousness of the inside was, was fantastic. And that was the first thing I noticed when we climbed in. What I noticed as part of that was how, how meticulous it had been maintained and, and the work that you had done to convert it and how well that was done. And loading the smart car, I told you earlier at dinner that um, I don't need to worry about remembering all the different steps because it was so logical and it was so easy to load the smart car. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, everything today has been uh, on the positive side. Everything's been, oh wow, I'm super happy about this. That's a relief that that's gonna work well. The six levels of, of uh, engine braking so that I can dial that in. Everything was just was just as I expected or far better than I expected. So well uh, thought every, out. Yep. So well thought out. How did the inside look? Amazing! It's amazing! It's just, it's so fun. How did your first drive feel? Well, I don't want to say like a ride at a carnival, but it was really fun. It was a fun, fun drive. It was the most fun I've ever had driving a vehicle. Ever. So I'd love, can you summarize, tell me about the plans you have for the next year with your rig? Sure, yeah, so I guess I've been the one that's been working on the kind of the logistics of the whole thing. And what we want to do is, so we started in California, um, we met up with Greg and Carrie here in, in 
Reno, Nevada to put everything together. And now we're going to hightail it basically to the East Coast, stopping and seeing our kids in, uh, in Colorado and in Pennsylvania. And then uh, get out to fall colors. Um, ideally, they'll still be hanging out in Quebec City uh, October 1st, which is when we plan to be there. Then three months down the East Coast, watching, you know, just going with the fall colors and looking at what we want to look at. And then kids fly into Florida uh, to spend Christmas and New Year's with us in Key West. And then they go back to school and we'll come across the Gulf Coast, uh, Arizona, New Mexico, uh, Southern Utah for like February, March, April, then up the Rockies, stop by Calgary, see Craig and Carrie. <laughs> um, maybe turn left, go to the, back to the West Coast and head home, or maybe turn right and do another lap around the East Coast. We're, we're really kind of open-ended on that part of it. Now that sounds like a dream trip. Yeah. Thanks for helping to make it happen. Well, I hope DJ does you does a good job for you. I know that uh, you're sure going to get a lot of attention at all the campsites <laughs> every time you stop and park. We even yeah. seen that today. Yep. What do we get? We got some thumbs up. Yep. We got some number Wave, eights number waved eights. at us in yep. the parking lot in our uh, travels today. So I hope he does you well. Yeah. We know yeah. he well. Thank you so much Thank for you everything so you've done much. to help us. It was our pleasure. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Great.